It's the ugliest building I've ever seen, I think. What a beautiful walk. The flowers are out in bloom. I'm not up for this. It might seem a bit lacy. We got picked up by Qatar and Elvira and we're going all the way to the waterfall. This guys is fermented mare's milk. <laughs> Wasn't known as Kimmitz. Is it not sure? Yeah, like a milky cider. Yeah, I think it's quite nice. We arrived in Tamga yesterday from Katsis Sai. We hitched like 30 kilometers. We checked into our guest house and then we didn't do much except for going to a very peculiar old Soviet Union sanatorium. If you come to Kamga, there's not much to do. We are walking around now and we're at this weird old sanatorium and the building behind me made from steel, metal, aluminium and inside there's a swimming pool. It's the ugliest building I've ever seen I think. Really really peculiar place. There is however from here a pretty good view of the lake. Well apart from Spence. <laughs> but it's, it's such an interesting complex it kind of gives you a inside into those old Soviet times and people going to sanitariums. Quite nice to walk around, I don't mind it so much. Marlon thinks this building's really ugly, but I think in its original form, before it got all kind of like messed up and rusty and stuff, it would have been quite impressive. So what did you think of that, guys? Have you been to a sanitarium anywhere? Anyway, back to the point of what we're actually doing here in Tamga. We are going to go up to Barskun Waterfall. Well, waterfalls, there are three of them. And we've got our tent with us, of course. So we're going to do some camping. And the people in the guest house were super nice, it's called La Dacha and they let us leave loads of stuff behind in the room free of charge and we'll have that room tomorrow night. So it's not as heavy, I feel like I'm 5-10 kilos lighter, it's great. <laughs> light as a feather. Well, maybe not quite light as a feather, now we've got loads of food. I'm light as a feather. But it is time to go and we've got 3 kilometers walk this way to the main road that goes to the waterfall. And what happens at the main road? You get a ride, of course. 18 kilometers up the main road, it's a long way. <laughs> a beautiful walk the flowers are out in bloom it's just like a sea of yellow over that way and then you've got the lake behind and on this side you've got the mountains beautiful walk i can't complain guys we just stopped to have a little talk with the horse or rather alex stopped to have a little talk with the horse I am actually a bit scared of them as I fell off when I was little. However, two years ago when my mum came to Kyrgyzstan, we actually went on a beautiful horse ride in similar kind of landscape to this and you can see the video up here if you're interested. We're stopping for lunch guys. We've basically reached the main road. There are only like 50, 60 meters left and from there we're going to hitchhike. But as we started this trek late, what time did we start? half 11 or so and it's nearly one o'clock now we're gonna stop for a bit of lunch we've got bread cheese cucumber and peanuts and water we are sorted that's all you need for a good lunch in the mountains we've got this smoked cheese uh, they have something similar in Uzbekistan and uh, maybe Kazakhstan as well but normally it's like in a stringy form like I don't know if anyone's had a uh, what's it called silly string cheese we used to have it when I was at school but it's really stringy and it's smoky and it goes very well with beer this one Smells very similar, so hopefully it'll be very good. So we've been walking for a couple of kilometers now since our lunch stop and only one vehicle has stopped. I think one other is coming now, maybe a tractor. While we were having lunch, while we were having lunch, there were several vehicles. Now let's see if this truck here will stop for us. Definitely not. He's driving really fast. Bummer. Oh, yeah, 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 car, car. They had space. Well, I'm not sure they had some kids in the back, I think. Oh, did they? That van looked like almost like a prison van. It looked kind of like a that's high a security. Second uh, van like that that we've seen. Mm. Maybe that's why they don't stop that. Yeah. They're driving really fast anyway. Hi. 
it's apparently 18 kilometers from where we are now or 17 or something and I don't fancy walking that especially as we're gonna go up a bit and it'll take us all day and it's already late so we just have to cross all our fingers and toes that there will be some traffic with cars that can actually stop and pick us up well we're gonna have to camp on the way somewhere and then Go up there tomorrow morning instead. And then come back down. And then come back down. Mm. It's quite a mission. Come in. Well, let's stay positive. Ah, hello. What's it doing? Where well, they fall. It was cool. Oh, let's carry on. We're only five kilometers to the junction where both roads join. Maybe there'll be more traffic there. Like I said, guys, there is no traffic. The few cars that are passing are going the opposite direction, like the one coming here now. We've walked 5.5 kilometers so far. Still got like 15 probably left. Hey, Tak. That means no thank you. I'm not up for this. It might seem a bit lazy, but I've got a bad back since a year and a half back. And yeah, it kind of uh, restricting me a bit. And I don't want to do too much. Or rather, I don't want to do more than my back can handle because I don't want to damage it more. And I think I'm probably already am doing what I should be doing with my back. Uh, so yeah, so I would love to get picked up. So we decided to take a bit of a rest because it is pretty hot in the sun. Found a bit of shade now. And yeah, normally when we hitchhike, even on uh, roads with not much traffic, we generally get picked up pretty fast. There's just been cars with like uh, flashing lights, you know, for police, ambulance, those kind of flashing lights. Can't think of the word. Yeah, a little bit of a rest. Hopefully a car will pass while we're sitting here. Now we're just going to have to continue. Hey, yeah. Almost time. We... Привет. Hello. We're going uh, waterfall, Podopod. Where are you going? We finally got picked up. And I think we're going to work for communication problems, but I really think we're going there. <laughs> Finally! We got picked up by Qatar and Elvira and uh, Sal in the back there <laughs> and Alebek. And they're going all the way to the waterfall. I don't know what the condition of the road is like all the way up there. And it looks like it might be raining, which is uh, wonderful. Another good omen. But finally we got picked up. <laughs> Top of the mountain, well not really, it's 2,700 meters, we've gone up a long way, it's windy, it's starting to rain a little bit, it's a little bit fresh, but have a look at the view, it is good. This guy is fermented mass milk, also known as kimis. I haven't had it for two years, so let's see if I still like it. I still like it. I think it tastes like cider. <laughs> you want to try it, Alex? Sure. Still not sure. But doesn't it taste a little bit like cider? Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot. <laughs> you still not like sure? Cider. Yeah, like a milky cider. Yeah, I think it's quite nice. There you go. Hello! Thank you so much for bringing us 
What's up here? Kyrgyzstan, Kyrgyzstan. It's a bit chilly, but it's absolutely beautiful. Really, really nice. Thank, Thank you so much. I love it. Bye bye. You are welcome. <laughs> Change of plans, guys. We're going back down again because the weather is not very nice. So we're going back to our guest house, and I think our lovely people here who picked us up are going to take us to our guest house. Well, what's the time, guys? Least the village. So yeah, the camping plans changed. We got Spiderman over here. Behind? There. Thank you so much, guys. They've uh, brought us all the way back to Tamga. Yeah, welcome. <laughs> it's very nice to meet you. Juan Stanaman, Stanaman. No. 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 Tanush Kanga. Tanush Kanga. Juan Stavos. Okay, it's completely wrong. <laughs> anyway, so we're back in Tamga and we're going to go back to the guest house. So, yeah, see you guys in a bit. Thank you. So nice to meet you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's get out. Have a, have a rest. Oh. Good, good day. Guys, that didn't turn out as planned at all. We are back in Tamga. We are right outside our guest house. So we're going to sleep there. We're not camping, as we mentioned already. So we think we're going to end the video here, actually. Yeah, that's right. So if you've liked this really weird, random video, it did not go to plan. Oh, excuse him. But that's just traveling, you know? Sometimes it doesn't work out. The weather was crap up there, so... Like my it's crap here, here as well. Actually, we can see the rain behind us coming closer and closer. <laughs> so I actually think it will rain here as well. It wouldn't have been very pleasant to be up on 2,000 something meters in the rain, I think. Yeah, that's Cold. right. Cold. So, as always, guys, if you liked the video, give it a little thumbs up or a big thumbs up. That's probably better. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell button so you get notified every time one of our videos pops up share our video mm. maybe you have a whatsapp group you can share it there please let us know in the comments do your days always go to plans or certainly don't i know we mentioned this in the outros of our videos before anyways we've got company in the back now hello hello hello, <laughs> hello goodbye <laughs> that's it for us guys thanks a million for watching as usual and we will see you in the next one bye, bye. What is this, guys? Have you ever seen anything like that? I don't know what it is. I have no idea. Is it very cucumber and two tomatoes? I think so. It looks very or peculiar. Two veg. Yeah, I think so. Something like that. And yeah, I don't know. We look pretty scary today. Yeah, I think we look very scary. Mean time zone junkies, gonna I'm get ya. <laughs> Where are we gonna sleep, Alex? Here. Here. It's not a good camping spot, love. Hi, yeah, yeah. The boys are watching our videos. <laughs> They're watching Time Zone Junkies on the phone. There I am. <laughs> Slight issue. Got to the guest house. It's locked. Can't get in. The number that we have that is on booking.com just goes to an answering machine. And now it's starting to rain.